I got an interesting video today. So I bought two units at this facility and I got my mom filming today. So we're gonna see who has the better unit. So I have a seven by 10, which I paid $180 for. And I have a five by 10, which I paid just $40 for. So mom, which one do you want? You can choose either one. Take the other one. All right, so my mom's gonna take the one we got for $40 which is the five by 10, and I'll go ahead and take the seven by 10. So let's go ahead and get started. But before we get too far into this video, did you know that only a small portion of y'all are subscribed? I got big plans for when I hit a thousand subscribers and I'm really close. So if you could subscribe, that helped me out a ton. All right, let's get into the video. All right, so let's go ahead and get started with this. It is some sort of office chair. It's definitely going to be my new office chair at the house because I need a new office chair. Alright, so I'm going to pull these out. Hopefully that wasn't important. Alright, so first box. Hopefully it's more than just blankets. Uh, it's a laundry hamper. Alright, so we got a... White elephant gift. <laughs> quite literally. <laughs> um, it's probably a, something Hindi related. If I had to guess. Um, speaking of elephants, a lot of blankets here too. Yeah, look at that. It's more Hindu stuff. I don't know if you can see that. It says fifty-three dollars and ninety-nine cents. So that could be good. And then uh, this thing here, which is awesome, purchased thirty-five dollars from Ross, which I think is just cool. I like that. Probably both of those things are going in my booth. Um, got some family photos, which I will return. And looks like that might be it for this box. Just more blankets and stuff, but the blankets are probably worth, I could probably get 20 bucks for the rest of the blankets. Then let's switch these around. Maybe not, that guy's heavy. Okay, looks like it's clothes for a start with some more photos. And some belts. Racing Club Black, I'm not sure what that is. Um, got some jeans, which can be good. But all of this will probably end up in a yard sale, more photos. So this box is mainly just clothes and stuff, which is fine, that's to be expected. Obviously it's not what you want to see. But that's how it goes sometimes. Let's get this one next. Yeah, we'll get it without knocking everything over. Okay, looks like some Christmas decorations. Lots of Christmas decorations. Mm -hmm. Got some uh, dodecahedrons and uh, bells inside of them. And then little table things, which I know nothing about, but those will definitely go in my booth. I don't know if Santa's going to go in my booth. <laughs> we'll find out. There's another uh, 
bench. Let's get that out of here. These are all just Christmas ornaments, which all this is just going to be at a yard sale or donation. I'm not sure. I don't know. That might end up in my booth. It's unique enough to where they might like it. This is interesting over here. Family. That looks pretty interesting. That would go really well in your booth. Yep. Yeah, so that'll end up in my booth. Uh, I've got this as well. Some sort of iPad knockoff or something, I'm not sure. Uh, it's like a book holder. Oh yeah, it's something. Oh yeah, it is a book holder. This smells interesting. Yeah. These are pretty cool. I don't know what they are, but they're a little, uh, I don't know. Keep those to the side. More of the, uh, oh, those are pretty neat. So let's go, that one has candle wax on it, I think. Uh, everything else, I don't think I want. like mom wants some of the peacock feathers. Because I won't do nothing with them, so she can have them. Alrighty. Where should I go next? I can't, I don't know where you're pointing to. Suitcase. Suitcase. Mom wants a suitcase. Because there's a big box underneath it. Suitcase time. There's a lot of nothing in there. I don't think scissors are allowed on airplanes, so I don't know if you could take that on an airplane. <laughs> nothing in there. Hopefully it's not just clothes. There. Some sort of purse. I'm not sure it says Luxie Collection. It says USD followed by a number, but the number doesn't make sense in USD, so I'm not sure. Tommy Hilfiger? Yep. 30 ducks. 30, 30 ducks. 30 bucks at Ross. Um, some brand new clothing. I'll keep that to the side. Dr. Seuss. And nothing else. I believe that is it. For that and now since I'm assuming you wanted the suitcase I should get you want me to get that big box next huh uh-huh okay the big box it shall be all righty oh. giant Barbie doll uh, my Coors bag with, what is this, Tommy Hilfiger, I think it's another Tommy Hilfiger, I think. Yeah, Tommy Hilfiger. So those are pretty good. Looks like there's another Barbie here. I don't know, it's a uh, something, I don't know. Very. Something for skates, looks like these are for these skates. Roller derby skates. So that could be good. That'll at least be a yard sale item. <laughs> so apparently that thing makes noise. Let's see if I can do it again. I don't know how. Here we go. Oh, here we go. It's a Ascend drone. Oh. And it looks like it does have power, which is nice. Hopefully I can find remote in here, but that could be good. 
Uh, I'll throw these off to the side. So those will be good. But I think that is it for this box. So I'll put this over here. Um, what the heck are you? Oh, this is the back to a recliner. Yeah, look at that. But we do have these nice chairs. I think this is actually a cover. But we have one, two, three, four, five of them. Oh, this might be number six here. I think it is. Um, but this one looks to be broken. It looks like the leg has broken off there. Which is unfortunate, but fine. Oh, this one's missing a leg too. Dang it. Oh, and this one's missing a front leg. Whatever this is, I hope it uses these legs. Because if it does, that's good. Let's go ahead and do this guy. You know, I think this is going to be kitchen. Only because it has a K. Yep, sounds like it. And it is. Uh, so I'm not going to go through this one. Um, it's kits and stuff. The size of it is, I can probably get 30 bucks for everything that's in there. I think this is going to be clothes. Dear. That's a shame. Well, I don't think I have to uh, open this one because it looks like it is just clothes. But I'm going to open it anyway. Um, simple ways to save time. Bank of America. Oh, what are these? Oh, I got $100. Look at that. 100 rupees. 200. 300. 320 rupees. What's that worth? Not a lot. Probably not. <laughs> Suitcase or box? Suitcase. Suitcase. Mom doesn't go through these often, so she doesn't know how disappointing suitcases can be. <laughs> Sometimes they can hold treasures. Sometimes they can. Like, I got a nickel. Look at that. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's something here. There's more of that um, jewelry type stuff. Toss that off to the side. So let's go ahead and do this last suitcase to get it out of the way. Empty. Empty. And wouldn't you know it, tablet. It's one of the crappy off-brand ones though. <clears throat> Some brand new clothing, some shoes that probably aren't worth nothing. These, I don't know what this is going to be. shiny reflective mirror. Lots of fake flowers. I thought this was a pineapple. I don't know if I'll put that in my booth or not. This definitely will. That'll be a couple bucks. Some more artificial little pebbles and stuff, I guess. Something live, laugh, love type of stuff. So that's it for that box. All right, so we're gonna go through these real quick because I have a feeling most of these probably aren't gonna be good. Uh, it looks like more of the same stuff that was in the previous one. Some greenery. This thing's kind of cool. Yeah, so that thing's pretty cool. 
Another cool little sculpture. Wow. So, nothing too wild in here. And then I think this one is gonna be kitchen, if I had to guess. And, these, oh, magnets. Yep. This is kitchen stuff to include food. So I'm not gonna spend any time on this. If it were heavy, I wouldn't open it, but I think it's all just more foliage. Foliage, foliage, whatever the word is. Greenery, got a globe, and more plants, and that's it. Oh, another kitchen box. And exactly what it is, although this is shiny. What are you? The, uh, this thing that was here is just the top of the, the recliner there. So that's probably really good. I went ahead and pre-opened up those two, or I guess the rest of the boxes we have, um, but I did not pre-open that. So yeah, let's uh, continue. So starting with this one, it says G for maybe garage, maybe games. Uh, maybe for garbage, I don't know. Um, but it looks like it's G for garage, which isn't too appealing. There. Nothing else crazy, I don't think. There's a bunch of shoes over in this corner, but they're all kids' shoes. So they're not going to be worth a lot. So go ahead and close that up. And we'll come down here for this one which looks to be more kitchen stuff. Um, yeah, and then the rest of this is just, uh, the rest of this is just kitchen stuff and nothing of crazy value. So I'll go ahead and close that one up. This is the second to last one. And it was a monitor. It's an Asus monitor. Oh, no, there it is. VN279. So that's the model number. So this box will end up going to Goodwill. So this will be my Goodwill box. All right. Oh. So this thing is really heavy. And I don't know what it is. So I'm going to be very careful when I open it. All right. Hopefully that's enough. That is a... What is it? Is it a bed frame? Um, the bottom of the chair. It might be. Because it's plugged plug in. Oh, you're right. It might be stuffed to the recliner. I'm going to assume this is recliner parts, so those probably go with the recliner. All right. So that's going to do it for my unit. So now we're about to go downstairs, open up mom's unit, and see who did better. For... All right. So this is the unit I got for $40. This is going to be mom's unit. This is the goal that she has to beat here. And uh, let's see if she can do it. So. Let's go ahead and get started, shall we? For $40, she doesn't have a, a lot to make up, so it's very possible that she beats me. Uh, nothing in there, looks like just a coffee maker. What are these? Uh-oh. Some, uh, some air rifle stuff. That doesn't bode well for me. <laughs> <laughs> A little, uh, it's like five dollars. I think these are pillows of some sort. Yeah, pillows or something. You're not getting any credit for that. Those aren't worth anything. <laughs> uh, looks like Ooh. a lawn chair and some kayak paddles. And another, another set. Lawn chair and kayak paddles. Well, you know what this is? It's a raft. It is a inflatable paddle board. I'm fairly certain. Yep. But yeah, it is an inflatable paddle board. So that's pretty good for you.
Oh, there's something in here. Oh, chips. Casino chips. Princess Cruises, $1. Uh, something. Canary. There's another casino. So these are actually like, yeah, these are actually dollars from casinos. So I'll give you $5 for those. Bring this out here, I guess. And try to go through it. Let's go over here. Family photos and stuff. So just say no to pot. These are nothing. Yeah. Uh, this is another inflatable paddleboard, I think. Yeah. I'm fairly certain. Oopsie. Or is it an air mattress? Importante. Oh, it's an air mattress. Little backpacking thing. I'll get to that in a second. I don't want to dump it. Let's see what we got. Put everything that's it's a sleeping bag, I'll keep that. That'll go to my yard so. I think that's a might be a hammock. Uh, yeah, 17 cents on the floor. Oh, I'll make sure to put that towards the toilet. Just more camping stuff. So that's not too bad. So it looks like I got a maybe a twin size bed frame there. Um, let's see what this is. I think these are bed frame slats. Yeah, I think that's for a bed frame. What are the odds we think we can move this and not make it this fall, huh? Not very good. Well, this didn't fall. Okie doke. Oopsie. There you go. Wow. It's a little rusted, but... It'll get the job done. Here's another one, a little bit rusted again, but it'll sell. So nothing else in there. However, that was a pretty good box for you. All right, I'm gonna leave those there because that is something I cannot show on YouTube. <laughs> okay. Yeah, much better. Okay, looks like some tools. Which can be good. Dang it. I think it's over here. <laughs> There's a jar of peanut butter. <laughs> yes. Yeah, there is indeed a jar of peanut butter. That's what I'm smelling. It expired two years ago. There's a... It's a... Oh, it's got peanut butter oil on it. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah, more DeWalt tools, which is good. That's a DeWalt battery charger, rather. And those are just extension cords. <clears throat> so that was pretty good. I'll be honest, I like your storage unit a lot better than mine. <laughs> so I think you made the right choice. Woohoo! Uh, this is a shelf. That's actually decent looking. It might just be better to put that on Facebook Marketplace for five, ten bucks. How big is this thing? Well, 55. 55 inch. Mom, I think you just won. Because <laughs> I'm fairly certain that this thing's in there. All right, Mom's going to open it. Yep. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> He's got a brand new 55 inch TV. All the goodies. Are that's that's pretty nuts. 
I think I got crushed on this one. Wow. Yeah, mom knows best. That's really good. That's insane. <laughs> I had, wow. And you paid 40 bucks? I paid 40 bucks for this unit. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you just got a TV. <laughs> All right, what do you think's gonna be in here? I have no idea. I mean, there's so much, so many different items. Ooh. That'll be good. Okay. Oh, look at those boots. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they're Ariat boots. They're in rough shape though. What does this say? Let's see. That's nothing. That's nothing. Shot glasses aren't nothing. Alaska Frontier Mint. Whitetail Alaska. Oh! <laughs> There's the air rifle. 760 Pump Master. It's now on safe. It was not on safe before. <laughs> so yeah, that's at least a little bit. The shoes aren't nothing. It's like there's just bags and stuff underneath it. So that's pretty good for you. But I mean, still, that doesn't, that pales in comparison to the television. <laughs> so we got what looks to be almost a brand new mattress here. Um, so that'll be probably 50 bucks. And then, the box spring is going to be 50 bucks with it too. So that's another 100 bucks right there. So, all right, this is the last box we got. So for some reason, they uh, taped this one shut. Probably just because it was too full. Yeah. Maybe not. A little turtle something or another. It was a heavy duty sleeping bag. So these are gonna be yard sale. Um, oh, what are you? Uh, somebody made a quilt. Maybe. 2004 American League champions. Lifetime Achievement and Dadliness, Jack Daniels. Corona, Georgia, Georgia White Sox, or uh, not Red, Red Sox rather. Uh, Georgia Southern. So that's a pretty cool little thing. It's very specific, which is unfortunate. Um, makes it more difficult to sell. Fragile, is what that says. Is a Georgia Santa ornament. Uh, some sort of baseball ornament. Atlanta Braves. Let's see here. Columbia jacket. It's probably like five dollars. And this says dolphin. Fragile dolphin. Remember, always cut towards yourself. That is not what I taught you. <laughs> well, we have to open this. There you go. Oh, that's pretty. John Perry. Little John Perry dolphin right there. It's marked on the bottom with uh, 1211. So I don't know if this is... Uh, a run in a series or or what but this thing is really really cool looking all right so that's gonna do it for today's episode i have a feeling uh that mom absolutely crushed me on this one i'll put up all the numbers for it so you'll see just how badly i lost but i'm gonna go ahead and give the win to mom i just don't know how much she's gonna win bye uh but if you guys did enjoy that video go ahead and like comment and subscribe it really helps me out and i'll see y'all in the next episode peace